to change the SSD and the HDD, we have to disconnect the battery first. This is your 2.5 uh, two inch HDD and this is your M2 SSD. So, get your uh, Phillips screwdriver and remove all the screws. Don't lose this, the cooling pad, just leave them as is. Now, just want to show. Okay, so this is the SSD we removed, and the one we're going to be putting in, it's um, 2. Point, uh, sorry, the M2, but this one is NVMe. I don't know if you can see it. Let me just, uh, you see this? Right here, NVMe. Now, in VME, what it does is actually, it's, it's a bit faster, but also it, it, it's good with the, the temperature. It doesn't heat up as bad as the normal M2. Mm -hmm. um, although we have the cooling pad, it's a good idea to use this one to speed up your laptop. So, Uh, so with the hard drive, we're going to be putting Samsung Evo 850 and although the operating system is going to be running from NVMe SSD to speed it up, this is one is going to be used just for the backup. And it's a good idea if you do them side by side because it's a lot of time it's pain when you just unorganizingly remove them and then you don't know where it goes, what goes where. So just the last things you wanna do, you wanna transfer the connector. That's it. Put your cover on and and then install Windows. That's pretty much it. These are actually um, empty, so I have to install the operating systems on that. If you want to learn how to install Windows, I'm going to put a link in the descriptions below on how to install Windows. And uh, that's it. Check out the descriptions. And if you have any questions, comment in the sections below. Share this video. Like it. Peace.